Hey guys, welcome back. I'm Alex, if you didn't know. So today I wanted to show you three easy placements for jewels, wearing jewels as eye makeup because Euphoria like totally brought that stuff in and I love it, uh, but it can seem a little bit daunting, I think. Um, but one of the coolest things about it is that like you can literally, like all I have, on, I have no eye makeup on right now except mascara. You can literally just wear it like that. And it's actually way easier than you think. So let's just get into it. So first up, the jewels. My faves are by Megs Cahill. I should probably just ask her next time I see her how to pronounce her last name. Um, but she has this brand called Get Stoned and they have the dopest stones, little jewels. Uh, like, look, I mean, it's kind of hard to see because some of them are backwards, but they're amazing. So they are not pre-sticky. Uh, the best thing in my opinion to use to stick them is one of the clear uh, brush on lash glues. I think this is just like the best. This one is Duo. I also have House of Lashes. Uh, what is this? Tati Lash. There's like a bunch of them, you know? Yeah. And then as far as like ap applicators go, Megs has this, uh, she's like a few of them I think, but it is an applicator which has like a little metal thingy. You may see this with like, if you get your nails done, nail art. Um, for like placing it. And then this guy is a waxy end so that you can pick up the jewel uh, and hold on to it and place it down. I've pretty much never used the metal end, but it's just me. Uh, you can also get the pre-sticky ones on like Amazon. They're just like not as glamorous looking. These are a lot more like shiny and um, impressive, I think. So I'm gonna show you three different placements that are like super cute. So I'm gonna start, uh, I'm gonna start, what? I'm gonna start off. <laughs> <laughs> with her gold ones. I don't know what any of the names are. They have names on the sites, but she, I think she changes up the styles like pretty often. So whatever, it'll all be linked down below. So I like to just put these out on like a little paper towel so that I have a bunch of them. And then the best thing to do, in my opinion, is decide where you want to place it first and use your little bl blush brush to pop the glue down, then pop the stone down because that helps you like put it where you actually want it. If you put the glue on the back of the stone and then try to place it, uh, it can like slide around and maybe it's not perfectly even with the other eye, whatever. So the first placement that I'm gonna show you is something that you may have seen on Saf Sephora. <laughs> maybe you've seen it on Sephora. Euphoria, what are you talking about? Uh, and it is the three right here. All right, so I wanna make sure that my eyelids aren't like covering them up. So I wanna make sure that I do it high enough. So I'm gonna place it up here. Now this works best if you let it get tacky. Um, you might wanna let it just like sit for a minute or two. Well, not that long, but you know what I mean. Now I'm grabbing my applicator, the waxy side and picking up the jewel. Place it right down. Boom, it's that easy. All right, this is number one, uh, which is my personal favorite because it's nice and simple. It kind of like helps to give a lift to the eye in my opinion. It's sort of like a cut crease almost, like you're defining the crease of your eye, but with the jewels, you know? And it looks really pretty with just lashes and like very natural makeup. All right, now that we know the tricks, my next placement is in a line right here on both lash lines, right in the middle. So I'm gonna place the first one. So you wanna make sure that like when you're looking straight ahead, um, it's gonna show up. So I'm gonna test kind of like the tilt of my eye. I'm gonna place it right in the center of my lash line. And I'm using kind of like, these look like blue-brown. This looks like the blue-brown pigment from MAC, if you guys know that. So right in the center of the top and the bottom. Once again, really subtle, super easy, takes two seconds, um, but it just kind of adds like a little elevated look to, I don't know, even just natural makeup. All right, and then the last one is rather than doing, I mean, you can do like a wing 
you know, with jewels, you can do, I mean, you can do pretty much anything, but I wanted to keep it nice and simple. So rather than doing like a full on wing, I wanna create like a little triangle on the outer corner of my eye to give like the appearance of a wing. It doesn't really matter where you place this, but I kinda wanna keep it like up higher in line with my upper lash line. So I'm gonna place it here to begin with. And then I wanna make a triangle. So I'm gonna go right above that with my second one. And then for the last one, I'm gonna go right here. So we're making just like a cute little triangle. And you could keep this lower down if you want, but I kinda of like to use my makeup to give my eyes a little bit more of a lift. So it's kinda of like a short little, like the end of a wing, you know? All right, and that's the last one. Super easy, really cute. Um, they take like, they took like no time at all, uh, but they just like, and you can do this with any look, whether it's like very natural like this, or if you have something like way more glam and you just wanna like elevate a little bit more, uh, you could place it on the, in your inner corner, you could line your brows with them. I think they're just like so much fun. And I don't know, I just like, every time I see somebody wearing it on like in an everyday makeup look, I'm just like, yeah, I love that. You know, I love what Euphoria did for like everyday makeup. Uh, all right, guys, that's it. Hope you enjoyed and uh, hopefully you learned something. I don't know. Hopefully this made you feel like a little more comfortable wearing this kind of thing. If you've been wanting to dabble, but you feel a little intimidated by it, it's so much easier than you think. And um, trust me, you're going to get compliments. People are going to be like, they're dope. All right. This is cute. I'm going to go now. Bye.